Hey guys, I'm here today to review another product for my review day series. Today is the Bubbling Bath Crystals. So this was another, uh, another new product they came out with, and it's bath salt, and if you've used bath salt before, most of them that I know of don't, like, froth up or anything. <laughs> That's the right word, I guess. And, but these will make bubbles, hence the name Bubbling. And the scent is in it's eggnog, bleep bleep bleep. <laughs> and <clears throat> this is just a little sample bag she sent me. And it's my honest review. I forgot to say that yesterday for the lotion I think I reviewed. Or in the chapstick. Anyway, um for ten ounces you yeah, you pay thirteen dollars and it's in like this long skinny like tube thing. And they recommend that you pour um, a fourth or to a half a cup of salt into the bath underneath running water so that it can make the bubbles and everything. It's SLS paraben and cruelty free just as all their, well, all their products are cruelty free. And then they state the SLS and paraben ones. And they claim that the natural mineral salts relax sore muscles and detoxify skin. Obviously, I need a bath. <laughs> so I just wanted to show you the product before I went. And it smells, I wouldn't say it's like dead on eggnog, but it's like a really spicy, creamy smell. And it smells really good. Like you can smell like the vanilla and stuff in it. And it's just, it just smells really relaxing and everything. So I'm going to use this whole bag and I'm going to take you to the bathroom and show you, you putting show you me putting them in to see if they bubble up or anything and granted um i got these a while back ago so if they don't bubble up i'm gonna kind of blame it on me not using it as soon as possible so let's just go see So I just got done taking my bath, and that was hella amazing. Plus, it's been a while since I've taken a bath, so that was just like heaven. Um, I just have my notes here, just like all the other videos. Uh, I was pleasantly surprised, as you saw by, well, you didn't see me get shocked, but um, you saw the mountain bubbles that it produced, which I was amazed. I was like, whoa, because uh, I was just expecting like just a few, you know. And bubbles always make a bath better, so I mean... Yeah, it was awesome. The smell was pretty much, it was very, very faint, if even there, once once you put the product in the water. Like, you can get, like, a whiff of it here and there, but overall, it's, like, gone afterwards. So, uh, because of that, there's no smell in your skin afterwards, but your skin does feel very, very nice. <laughs> um, it feels really smooth. And also another thing is the bubbles died down about, I don't know how long I was in the bath. I think the bubbles died down about after mm, maybe 8 minutes, like 8 to 10 minutes, they started to die down. So, I mean, you don't want to stay in the bath forever, so it's kind of, it kind of evens it out. But it was a very nice bath, and I would, I would, I would buy a big one of these. I still have to check out the re uh, the bubble bar, so I'm going to do that within the next day or two, hopefully. That's planned, but if it actually happens, who knows. But yeah, if you want to learn more about this, check out my blog post link below, and I have a written review and a picture of the bag and product. And yeah, so go check this out, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for the finale of the review series. Bye.